North Dakota's health department has people on call ready to reach out to anyone who has tested positive with COVID-19. The state has previously said these contact tracers are all health professionals. But as Valley News Team's Joshua Pagero found out, that's not always the case and the role comes with its challenges. If you've tested positive for COVID-19, you've most likely talked to a contact tracer. Luke Unger works for the North Dakota Department of Health. He assigns cases to investigators who notify people that they've come in contact with an infected person. A big issue is just non-compliance and people not really caring. Unger says some of the people don't take it serious. Like we've had people attending events while they know they are a case and they've tested positive and they just do it just because. One contact tracer says she has called law enforcement before, especially on someone who is homeless. So it's really a challenge to deal with like young people and say like try to make them understand. Some people will say, okay, yeah, I'll do it, but they don't end up isolating and still hanging out with friends. Contact tracers receive a 59 page manual that states they may choose to call the attorney general, county or city attorney if someone is non-compliant. Contact traces also sign a non-disclosure agreement. Um, so really, I think the hardest thing is narrowing it down to where they possibly have gotten it. A lot of it is community spread at this point, or they have had direct contact with a confirmed case. Back in May, the health department told us all contact traces have a health background. Is our preferred qualification, you might state it, um, are those with a, a health background or they're in a health related degree. Um, but I have hired students that are not from a health related degree. Angela Evenson of the University of North Dakota says she has contact traces with a social work or communications background, and she's looking to hire at least 30 more. The intention is to expand the pool to ensure that there are enough traces of need be. In Fargo, Joshua Piguero, Valley News Live.